back to get a nose on them. That's right. We have a beer, uh, beer bat unboxing here, beer mail, courtesy of a good man, Jay, and this guy's thoughts. Thank you very much, Jay. Cheers to you. Just got home, opened it up, didn't look in, just want to make sure everything was good. So I'm going to move this over, see what we got in here. First one up, and my man individually ziplocks each one. You're doing it right, Jay. First one up is I'll save that. We use those. This is Center of the Universe, Fatheads Brewing, Columbus Brewing Company. Oh, I guess it's a collaboration. Okay, yeah. Okay, Fatheads and Columbus Brewing. This is double IPA. Ohio-made collaboration. I guess they're both from Ohio. All right, that, looks, that sounds pretty cool. Yes, Columbus. 8% ABV. Cheese, racing, skiing, corn, lakes, national parks. Okay, pretty cool. I've never heard of these, any of these guys. Keep that. Got a nice double there. And number two. Oh, date. It has a date of August Thursday, so super fresh. We're in September 6th. Alright, uh, Corks and Cakes. That's a cool label. It's like two uh, Nordic dudes sitting at a bar drinking beer with a dog with a shirt and a captain's hat on. Alright, the people your parents warned you about. 7% New England IPA. Listerman Brewing Company. Never heard of them either. I guess they're local. Cincinnati. Alright, I'm going to have to wear my... Bengals jersey for this one. That's a cool label. I like that label. Let's see what we got next. From the Heart, Volume 2. Hazy, 8% IPA. A statewide collaboration beer supporting the Ohio Craft Beer Association. I'm with that. I like that. Okay, Land Grant. Brewed by Land Grant, okay. Sponsors. Oh, it's got a bunch of sponsors. Country Malt Group. Great Western Malting. Blue Label Packaging, okay. Origin Malt. Crosby Hops. Wow, okay. And they, they went all in on this one. And Brewing Can by Land Grant Brewing Company. Columbus, Ohio. Another local joint. All right, I'm with that. Damn, Jay, you went nuts, dude. <laughs> There's a lot of stuff here. Taxman Brewing. Now, that might have hurt. I know I had one from them. I don't know who gave it to me. It might have been him. Belgium-inspired, American-crafted, pineapple payment. Pineapple payment. Mojito-inspired white ale with fruit and mint. Okay, that's different. I'm going to have to bring the wife in on this one. Jenny? It's a mojito-inspired white ale with fruit and mint. Barbersville, Indiana. Taxman, I know I had something from them. I'm pretty sure Jay gave it to me. And this is 5%... Uh, ABV and IBUs of 12. That's pretty cool. Something different right there. Oh, all right. I see what he did here. Right, this one I'm familiar with. He sent me these before. Actually, I did two of these with the wife. She liked them. This is Red Martian. Sour ale with natural flavors. It's a, it, the Red Martian. I, I know we did Blue Martian. And we did another one. Contains lactose. 5.6%, uh, I'd be using 8, but well, what's the flavor? What's red? I'm guessing berry. They're from Cleveland, Ohio, platform uh, beer company. Oh, here it is, okay. Overfruited, slushy style, sour, notes of fruit punch, vanilla, and tart. That sounds fantastic. Jenny will get that, because she's had the other two, and she liked them both. So did I. We had a blue can. Jen, do you remember the other one? One that looked like this? With the Martian on it? I know we had the blue. Yeah, I remember. 
And we had another one. We had two, I think. This one's Fruit Punch. I remember the blue one. Yeah, it was Blue Raspberry. Fantastic. Go back and watch that video. Uh, that review, I already dropped that. Okay. Metazoa Brewing Company. Never heard of them. Drink beer. Help animals. Help with that. Okay. <laughs> Hopopotamus. Hopopotamus. So I guess it's a, it's a hippo on there. It said hippopotamus. It's hopopotamus. This is an IPA. Batch MBC dash hop. Don't know what that means. A bright citrus aroma from citra and mosaic hops, balanced by light sweetness from vanilla, vanilla malt. Vanilla malt. I don't know what that means. Uh, Brewmaster John J. Hall. Don't know him. Seven percent ABV, seventy IBUs. Those are good numbers. Um, that's a whole passage. I'll read that when, when I get into it. So this is something different too. Never even heard of these guys. I like that. Saying it's saving animals. I don't know how, but drink beer, help animals. And maybe it's in this passage. So when I actually get down to review it, we'll figure all that out. Line one there. All right, Brew Dog. I've had one. I just had actually I reviewed one not too long ago. Uh, I think he gave it to me. Um, Hellcat, or something like that. Brew Dog Fellowship IPA, five percent ABV. The Lord of the Rings. Okay, hazy Indian pale ale, and they are out of Ohio. I know that. Well, they're originally from England, but I, I know they're from out of Ohio now. Pretty cool, right there. So that'll be my second one from them. Oh, here's another one I'm familiar with. We've had a couple from them, all from him. Urban Artifact, Bushel. Spiced apple fruit tart. Okay, I'm with that. We did a blueberry one from them. That was fantastic. It was like 18 something, 17%. This is 4.5%. So a low ABV. Bushel spiced apple fruit tart. With it. I've had two or three from them. Every one I like. This fruit tart has one third of an apple and a smidge, smidgen of salt, a speck of vanilla, and a dash of baking spice in each can. Sounds pretty good to me. That's like a um, that type of year, like uh, maybe, what's the date on this? August, maybe around Halloween. I'll get to that bad boy, we'll see. I don't know, maybe I'll save that for like a Halloween for, for that time, you know, like a, at the fall here. Last one up. Brink Brewing Company. Never heard of these guys. El Search for El Dorado. New England style IPA, 6.8%. I hope it's El Dorado single hop. That would be awesome. Love El Dorado. Sing yeah, single hop series, exclusively El Dorado. All right, that's cool. So now I get to really dive into what El Dorado brings out. I've had El Dorado many times, but it's always mixed with other hops. So that's pretty cool. Sweet golden pineapple, endless riches await. Okay, I'm with this. El Dorado single. I don't think I've ever had a single hop to El Dorado. They are out of Cincinnati, Ohio. Brink Brewing Company. So there we go. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. You're a good man, Jay. You're doing everything right. So I got me. Thank you very much. Appreciate it. I'm going to dive into these when I get to them. I got a whole slew of stuff to get to, so I'll get to it. Don't you worry about it. So I got you. Thank you very much, my good man. Peace.